right, we're good. Visual history of Bung Choi in the last 100 years. Cheers. It's 2020 and you have Bung Choi being streamed, all the applications with the Ravenswood Academy. You go back a generation to say the 80s and uh, Mantis master Brendan Lai is demonstrating this for a big crowd in Seattle. These pictures are also ending up in martial arts magazines like Black Belt, Inside Kung Fu, him demonstrating the technique, books from that time period, etc. Go back just another decade and you have Wong Han Fun's retirement ceremony. Students are throwing Bung Choi's or Bung Da's left and right. Two decades before the retirement ceremony in the 50s, you have the books that Wong Han Fun is going to write, pictures of him numerous times performing Bung Choi, students throwing it, different stances, different scenarios where you would use that technique. Speaking of all these Mantis manuals, we know that Bruce Lee had a significant collection of them. He specifically highlights Bung Choi, draws in the opponent in his own personal copy of the book, and he's going to explode onto the screen in the 1970s and visually introduce Bung Choi to a large amount of Westerners for the first time. And then there is Ben Armstrike using the waist again into a back fist. A little detour, not from my line of Mantis, but we do have early photos of Wei Xiaodong and Li Kunshan uh, demonstrating this technique. These were people who had military experience, fought in tournaments, knew how to brawl. Again, not my line, but very cool to see other masters doing that. So to whomever shared those photos, thank you very much for sharing. Back to our line, we have Lo Kuang Yu demonstrating Bung Choi three different times in the seminal mantis form Bung Bo. While the book is published in the 50s, the actual photos are probably from the 40s or 30s. Because Bung Choi is within the Bung Bo form, which we have records of people performing at the turn of the century, we can very safely say that it was being performed in the 1800s. Now, how far back after that can you go? Can you go back to the 1700s and find Bung Choi? Can you go back uh, even further to Qi Ji Guang in the 1500s and can you find Bung Choi or Bung Da? Well, at least one student of Wang Han Fun thought you could. Wang Han Chao is going to make the argument that elements of Mantis go all the way back to Qi Ji Guang in the 1500s. So some Mantis practitioners are going to argue that Mantis is largely a product of the 19th century, but others are going to say, hey, dates back a thousand years. So a different discussion or topic for another time, but uh, something we'll maybe explore in a future video. But for now, that's all I have for you. So thanks for watching.